Hey everyone, thank you for joining me. Much love to each and every single one of you. Thank you for all of the likes, the shares, the subscribers, the feedback. I love it all. Thank you. Um, this video, I decided that I was going to do a quick tarot card reading with the Ascension in mind. So I thought I would ask my guides, or angels, whoever is listening on the good side on the high positive side. I thought I'd ask them, how is the ascension going? <clears throat> now I've stopped um, watching so much of uh, the information that's coming out. So this will be news to me. I hope you find it useful. <clears throat> I just shuffled my deck. <laughs> Naughty. <clears throat> you ready for this? I'm not going to look up uh, anything. I'm just going to give you my idea on what the cards say. So the first card, I love seeing this card. The Ten of Cups. Now, to me, the Ten of Cups, because it's the right way up as well, <clears throat> is indicating um, a celebration, a reward, um, good things happening, um, jovial moments, uh, laughter. As, yeah, definitely a celebration um, <clears throat> because of the rainbow. I see it as um, some kind of event celebration going on. Um, Maybe a, a win of some sort, um, success of some sort. One, in, in numerology, the number 10 obviously means one, which is new beginnings, um, new starts. Uh, it could also symbolise uh, unity. So all round, that is a good card for the question, I think. Ooh, this next one. The Wheel of Fortune card, and it was the right way up. Now, you could see that in many ways. However, the idea, as far as I know it, is that we have to clear our karma by forgiving ourselves and all others. So for this to come out, I think that means that, especially next to this card, I think it relates to how we've overcome something and we've stepped onto this new um, this new cycle so to speak and the next card and yes it's, it came out upside down is the seven of swords upside down now at first it looks like the man is smiling so he's kind of scurrying away as far as I can tell he's treading lightly and he's only carrying five of the seven swords. So it might symbolise some things being left behind and other things moving on into a different area. He looks like he could be up to something. You know, like he's outside of the area where it is being inhabited. And he's kind of sneaking away with these, with these things. So I think that maybe that could be relating to the idea of some beings coming along and some beings deciding otherwise because he's he's on his own there's nobody around him so I think it's about um, a decision for some of us and the number seven relates to uh, spiritual matters so I would say that it is the spiritual choice that we're all going through whether we are going to continue with the path of ascension and some are going to drop out and maybe not not want to or not want to take part so that is my little reading in regards to how the ascension is going let me know how i did if you got use out of it um let me know your take on the cards because we all have different perspectives and i love that we do um i love you thank you for joining me and i'll be back in a bit